point, it does not appear they are a threat. <laughs> I, uh, I will, in fact, read that one more time for you. Uh, this is the March of the Dead. As you were burying this, uh, the, your, uh, the Burgomaster, an eerie green light suffuses the graveyard. From this light emerges a ghostly procession, wavering images of, do of doughy women toting great swords, woodwise men with slender bows, dwarves with glittering axes, and archaically dressed mages with beards and strange pointed hats. All, all these and more, uh, all these and more march forth from the graveyard. Their numbers growing by the second. These are not the spirits of the people buried here, but previous adventurers who died trying to destroy Strahd. Every night, the ghostly procession, the ghostly adventurers attempt to complete their quest, and each night they fail. This is where we left off. Now, um, they're here. They're there. Adventurers on parade. <laughs> here they come. Hippity hoppity. <laughs> it worked out very well, actually. Uh, at this point, <laughs> um, Ismark is he is uh, he is pleased with everything that came forth from this. Um, he is going to take care of his needed business as the new burgomaster of the village of Barovia. Irina do, 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 is going to join the party. Where is Irina? There you are. Hello. As, as in the party of ghostly adventures, or as in our party? As in your party. Uh, show to everyone. Come on. Edit. There we go. Irina. In players' journals, yes. So much like in a, much like in a, uh, in Final Fantasy, um, you have temporary allies that join you on your quest. Um, she is going to be one of them. Is she up top now, or is she? Nope. I still have to keep that tab open. Okay. Uh, going from there, she says, she, "I am ready." I, I, I appreciate Donovich. I appreciate everything that you've done for us. Thank, to thank you very much. Um, she burps. She had too much coffee earlier. And, uh, I, I recognize that it is midnight in, in Barovia currently. Um, however, I am now prepared. Uh, I feel at ease and prepared to go with you, to travel with you, to be escorted to the town of Valaki. Val, Val, Valaki. I had it right. Um, what would you like to do? Would you like to wait till morning, quote unquote, whatever morning is in the world of Barovia, or would you like to sally forth currently? Should we set up camp in the graveyard? <laughs> also an option. Uh, I mean, I, I suppose don't... I'm game, but we do. Oh, sorry, Rebel. I don't plan to. <laughs> <laughs> I just... I assume that there's an inn somewhere in this uh, village, and or perhaps, you know, Irina may be able to assist us with lodgings for the evening, and we can get our breath, maybe have a nice breakfast, eat our moon pies before, or our dream pies before we go oh. to bed, and uh, refresh ourselves. Well, here, here's the thing. If we're talking the undead, most of the undead venture out at night, if we're trying to get sleep at night and they keep us awake all night, we won't be able to be any good during the day anyway. We may as well travel at night. Yeah, uh, levels of exhaustion are still very much a thing. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I'll raise my feathers and, and shake about. Uh, no monster left behind? And then in the screaming kid voice, Father, I'm starving! Leave me! <laughs> One must die, I think, yes? Jesus Christ, it's weird. I'm full. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can always practice in the basement. There's an option. Uh, Donovich, who's standing right there, says, Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. I will disregard his, his whoa, 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 unsheathe my hammer, get my shield, and calmly stroll towards the... Oh, here. shit, we're doing this. Okay, let me go back to another page here. Hold on a minute. 
<laughs> uh, you enter in through the chapel doors. Uh, you kick them open as one as an adventurer, in fact, would. Uh, the doors, of course, reveal a 10-foot wide, 20-foot long hallway, brightly lit chapel, blah, blah, blah. Uh, two doors on your left, two doors on your right. Uh, the chapel itself is strewn with, uh, with debris. Oh, wait, I have to go to a different map. I'm sorry. And, and I suggest we try talking to the little demon child before we just outright kill him. I mean, you know, murder hobo or, or uh, diplomacy. <laughs> I mean, I suppose we can see where things are at. I mean, whatever he happens to be at this particular time, he has enough wherewithal to uh, speak and ask for food in a semi-intelligible way. He's cursing his father, and that's relatively normal. <laughs> and, and he may have some uh, intelligence for us on what it is to expect. So. Now... Is Mark? You are not here. Donovich follows okay. you in. Uh, Tortel, D Dostath, you are the first individual at that door. I moved you there. This is D. I'm looking at trapped. Uh, wait. A B C D. E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T Sorry. Uh, time and neglect have punched holes in the ceiling of this moldy room, which contain a few broken roof shingles amid puddles of water. In one corner, set into the floor, is a heavy wooden trap door held shut with a chain and a padlock. A young man's screams of anguish can be heard through the door. Father! What? I'm starving! Sorry, that is what I'm describing here. Is here. And what would you like to eat, young child? <laughs> Ooh, this internet is so rough. Uh, is, oh! Boy, hello! And what would you like, young child? Hold on, let me get back to what's his name? <laughs> Little horse, uh, Doru, Vampire Spawn, Church, uh, Doru, Doru, I, I'm starving! Oh! There's a voice! Hello! He says, Hello! Uh, here, I'm gonna do this too. Wait a minute. Dink! How's that? Haha! -ha. Hello! <laughs> can you, I can, I can hear you! Can you hear me? You seem to be talking from a previous adventure through someone's asshole. It's true! <laughs> <laughs> the cat butts are everywhere. Can you come down? Come downstairs. Bring me some food. I'm starving. Oh, my God. Well, you said you're starving, but what is it you wish to eat? Anything. Bring to me anything. Just bring to me anything. What's the first thing that comes to your mind? Flesh. That might be a problem. But everything living has flesh. Bring me a chicken. Bring me some duck. I want the roast beast. A good pheasant goes a long way. <laughs> are you sure that's what you want us to ask? Wait, are you talking to Rebel? No. Oh. oh, you're talking, you're talking to Doru. Say it again. Are you sure that's what you want us to ask for? I don't think the bar serves anything. And it would take forever to get it to you anyway. I don't care. Bring to me something. I need, I need flesh. I need blood. Please, I'm starving. Please! Oh, you need blood now, too. When did it get to be blood? I oh, my God! <laughs> Anything! God, I've been down here for weeks! I've got bread and rations. Fantastic! Bring them to me! Now, we have a chain oh, covering a... You do. It is true. Uh, cool. you, there is a... Oops, I lost the page. Uh... In one that corner... Oh, sorry, go ahead. Having a chain over a trap door does not bode well. No, it does not. Uh, in the corner is set into the floor a heavy wooden trap door held shut with a chain and a padlock. 
uh, and the young man's heard screaming, so on and so forth. Sorry, I'll come back here. Sorry about that. Hello, I've returned. Sorry. Mr. Bonnicus, do you have a key to the lock? We need the, you need the key. Sorry, say it again. You're you're talking to who? Donovich. Father Donovich. The, the uh, priest? Donovich, yes. Donovich approaches. He also approaches you. You have a key. I apologize to inform you that I do not, in fact, have the key. Uh, the key has been lost. How long has the child been below? Several weeks. How have you been feeding him? I have not. That's it. <laughs> Good idea. You're a piece of shit. I'm not a great dad. <laughs> You're a terrible father. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm>... <laughs> have you uh have you have you met ismark a terrible father terrible yeah. son you might get along swimmingly we actually wait are you talking to are you talking to Don, donovich yes yes yeah no he's uh yes i i ismark and i we, we go way back let me tell you we have beat all the children in this town we hate them all fuck these kids he doesn't say that. That's rude. Uh, while they're bantering, say it again. While they're bantering, I'm going to walk over and I'm going to uh, break the lock off with the hammer. I need Don't a strength check. No, I need a strength check from you then, please. What's well, why? That's just what my character thinks. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. Uh, oh, no, go ahead. It's <laughs> This is like Willy Wonka. And he's like, Don't stop. Come back. No, no. We have 14. Plus success uh, with a single blow with a single strike to this uh, this padlock uh, it flies off uh, you take the chain out um, you hear excitement coming from down below below is a wooden staircase that descends 15 feet into the undercroft if I can redirect your attention to the right half of this map um, I'm going to place Irina over here on the stairs. A little bit of light shed on my hammer for me. Again. You... <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Undercroft. Uh, the church's Undercroft, it says, has rough-hewn walls and a floor made of damp clay earth. Rotting wooden pot pillars strain under the weight of the wooden ceiling candlelight from the chapel above seeps through the cracks allowing you to glimpse a gaunt shape in the far corner and that is all it says uh he sees you enter he sees the uh, the, the lot of you enter Oh! Oh, thank God! Oh, and look, you can see me. I don't have to turn my camera off now so I can pretend like I, you can't see me. You can see me now and I can see you! Please! Please give me some food. I'm starving. I pull out a ration and throw it down the stairs. Uh, I don't think he's chained down there. Sorry, give me one moment. No, he does not appear to be chained. He's uh, so I'm landing at the bottom of the stairs. He's going to scurry his ass over uh, to the bottom of the stairs. He's going to pick up the ration. He's going to shove it in his mouth. He's going to chew it. He's going to kind of swallow it. Some of it falls out of his mouth, little crumbs and bits. I'm assuming this is like lamas bread from the elves. No, this is like hard tack. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not tasty. This is not what he's requesting. Please, no, please. No, he says, please, you have to anything. Give me meat. Give me blood. I need something. Please. You said you were fine with rations. I said I needed, I said I needed, uh, 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 Meat. I said I need flesh. I need blood. Please. Well, I mean, that's what hardtack is. It's dried flesh. <laughs> it's not enough. I need more. Please. 
you have to help me and he's he's going to uh come on disappear thank you he's gonna he's gonna advance slowly up the stairs and he's he's inches from oh that was the wrong move he's yes he's inches from the turtle he's inches from dostoff he's as you see these claws these these long pointed nails i'm not even sure if i have a a picture of him here uh wait for it wait for it i bet you i do somewhere here um taroka strahd letter death house werewolf wait for it church 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 oh that's the church itself um i don't i don't have anything to show you i am very sorry uh, but he does. He claws. He claws at the at the at the turtle. He claws at Dostoff. He says, "Please, please, I can smell it on you. I can smell the blood. Please give me something." I have none for you. I'm gonna cast hold person. Ah! Uh, I'm going to cast hold person. Yeah. On um, that thing. To keep them from advancing. Yes. I have a hike finger. Would you like a hike finger? I can smell it. It is also dry. It's it doesn't have any blood in it. It's it's old. <laughs> His eyes seem crazed, but you have hold person on him, which does which what uh, move movement to zero? Is that correct? Uh, target must um, throw a wisdom saving throw or be paralyzed for the duration for a minute. At the end of each of its turns, the target can make another wisdom saving throw. On a success, the spell is ended. You can always click it and add it to the chat, like this, in case you need. Oh, did that not work? How did you do that? There it is. You click on it. Uh, your, what uh, is? And then uh, you go his to spell. wisdom saving throw is an eleven. Does that beat whatever I'm looking for? Uh, I'm a fourteen, I believe. Then it sounds like he failed, and he is held. Uh, he is held in place, uh, but there is a turtle in front of him. He may not be able to move, but he's going to make an attack. I'm not sure if we're going to need this initiative tracker. Are we going to need this initiative tracker? Clear. Right, add a turn. Oh, oh, okay. So you right click. Add a turn. You can shortcut control U to quickly add groups. Let's How do, do it you anyway. add? What? Is, what? No, it's not what I wanted to do. Mm. <laughs> How do you add yourself to the? Uh, if order? you. What is that? I think you just roll for initiative. If you, yeah, if oh. you, uh, if you click on, if you click on your guy, uh, whilst you have your character sheet open. As long as your dude is selected, you can click initiative and it'll add you in. Okay. Select dude. Select open sheet. Character sheet. Load. Character sheet. Initiative. Initiative? Oops. How do you that? Oops. I might have got my character sheet open. I rolled three for my <laughs> What did I roll? I can't even tell you this. You got twenty-five point one eight. Oh damn, Ninja! I'm behind you though. Three point one. <laughs> Where the hell are these points coming from? Explain Where, to me why there's points on these. <laughs> I don't know. It's something to do with the with the. I think it's just for the math. Yeah. Probably like somebody's dex is higher, like. You know, when two people roll the same number, if somebody has like a higher oh, dex, then I their mean. initiative goes up, and it's probably all a part of their 
Sorry, I forgot a person. I, I forgot we have Arena in the, in the group. Oh my god, come on. There we go. Arena, and then who are we missing here? Me, because I can't, I'm not, not, not knowing what you're doing. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Here, yes, on. of course. Uh, um, if you, if you then. click on your, on your, uh, icon, um, just one, yes. si a single click on your icon, hold down alt and then double click on your icon as well. You should pull up your, your what? character sheet. Hold on. I have my character sheet open. Perfect. Now, on your character sheet, uh, if you just click uh, the word initiative, I believe. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. All right. Instead of being stupid and clicking the number, you actually click the word. Yeah. And not the number. Okay. Gotcha. I know. It's, it's, it's so intuitive. Why are you it at the bottom? So well. All right, now I have reorganized this. It got organized. Um, he ha currently has a uh, Doru. Currently has a, um, a movement of zero. Um, he cannot go anywhere. And it is Rebel's turn. Rebel, what would you like to do first? Uh... Please give me some food. Any claws at the turtle? Uh, I will tell him his uh -huh. mother was a hamster and his father smells of elderberries. Perfect. The opposite. It hurts really <laughs> bad. <laughs> uh, one action. Do not understand. Is a seed and a wisdom saving throw or take 1d4 psychic damage? Here we go. Doru. Wisdom. 13. It is a failure. Please give him some damage. 24. It's a 2. But he has disadvantage on his next attack roll. Disadvantage! Minus 2. two. Damage. Uh, would you like to move in any particular direction? I will not move, but I will inspire the tortoise turtle in front of me kick his ass sea bass <laughs> <laughs> um how do i represent so disadvantage he is net there we go all right we're gonna leave it that he is stuck in place at the bottom of these stairs uh tortoise you <laughs> Um, anything further? Rebel? Nope, that's it. Bang! It goes to Doru! Now Doru is going to attempt to break free from this, uh, this grapple that you made. Uh, can he do that on his turn? Uh, he, at the end of his turn, he can, uh, attempt to break free from the whole person by rolling another uh saving throw okay but other than that he can't move. He's paralyzed. he cannot move so he is instead going to attempt to claw at oh it's gonna be fucked up claw at <laughs> dostoff he's, par he's paralyzed oh is he he can't move whatsoever or he it's not just movement sorry read it one more time the descriptor Choose a creature that you can see within range. That target must succeed on a wisdom saving throw or be paralyzed for the duration. Uh, this spell has no effect on the undead. Oh. Oh. Huh. Okay. Then I'll, I'll I'm just... Shutting up now. I'm going to give you one of those, and I'm going to move anyway. <laughs> um, um, gotcha. He's undead. He is undead. He is going to take a nice swipe at the turtle in front of him. Hold on, vampire technology. Uh, uh, which one of can be a bite? Okay, so on his first attack, he's going to swipe at you with his claws. Uh, an attack with a 26. 
Oh, but it's disadvantage, you said. Yes. So he's actually attacking with an 11. He is attacking the turtle with an 11. Thank you. And then I'm going to use nope. cutting nope. words on his. Um, nope. What is cutting he words? Um, once you roll and make an attack, I can use a d6 to... But you said he had two attacks? Uh, he missed on his he missed on his first one because he has okay. disadvantage from your first thing. Uh, his Got second it. attack, on the other right. hand, he's going to try and bite the turtle on his shell because he's a dipshit. Is this also disadvantage? It doesn't really matter. He still gets an eight either way, which also does not hit you. Uh, and then he's going to make a movement because his shit is failing left and right. Uh, he is going to go... <laughs> Can I do this? Oh, look at that. Five. Uh... There. He's going to go over there. Bloop, 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 bloop. Ready. I'll go the opportunity attack. And yes, opportunity attack from the turtle. Please give me I'll something. I'll make that opportunity Uh, that is going to be a 21. To hit. Holy shit. Um. Drop the baby. Natural. Four. 15. Give me some damage. It's going to be seven damage from a silvered weapon. That's it? You don't get a plus anything? 1d8 plus 3. There it is. Oh. Uh, and that is the end of Doru's turn. It's going to Irina. She's going to charge in as well. She's going to go... 5, 10, 15, 20. She's going to charge in right over here on the other side of him and flank the shit out of him. She's going to pull out... Come on, open. She has a melee weapon. She has a rapier. She's going to attempt to hit this motherfucker. Real quick. Uh, with a nine that I don't think does anything. Nope, she missed. She has moved. She has attacked. She is going to pass to Autumn. Autumn! Kill some motherfucker. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to sigh as our brand new ally runs right up to the fucking uh, 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 zombie. Despite the fact that she has an entire entourage alongside her, she's decided to rush forth in this case. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to... She's brazen. Two, five, 10, 15, 20... 25... I'm going to get myself off the stairs and into the room. Perfect. And then I am going to do 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 da 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 wow. <laughs> da 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 da. Does it have this spell on here? Of course, it doesn't have this fucking spell on here. Of course. Why would it make it easy on you? Anyway, so um, I am going to cast, cool. considering that she's the fleshy human <laughs> and not the hard turtle. Right. <laughs> I'm going to cast protection from good and e uh, protection from evil on her Fantastic. with an undead focus. Um. Which basically that is. So, the protection grants several benefits. Creatures of those type, in this case undead, have disadvantage on attack rolls against the target. The target also can't be charmed, frightened, or possessed by them. And if the target is already frightened, charmed, or possessed by such a creature, the target has advantage on any new saving throws against the relevant effect. So basically... Any attack made against her by the undead will have disadvantage. I love it. Uh, let's give her some wings instead. 
So she has a, if you notice on her token, she has a, she has a set of wings there. That is to represent that, that she's, uh, protect, being protected from good and or evil. Watch yourself. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, anything further? Uh, no, I'm pretty sure that takes care of all of my actions for the turn. I think it goes to Theoth. Uh, where are you? You were way over here by the stairs. How would you like to act? So I'm going to go down the stairs and come into this range here. Mm-hmm. And... <laughs> What's that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you do like a leapfrog over him. <laughs> Tumble down the stairs. Hardcore that, parkour! That Hard parkour! If that's not an option, I... No, 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 no. Fly on me. No, it's, I, I want you to be able to crawl through this turtle's legs. I want you to get down on all fours and, like, pull yourself underneath it. Like the, uh, yeah, make it like nice it. and awkward. And Basically, you can always pass take... through allied squares, but, yeah, just flare. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and from there, I'm going to do uh, Ray of Frost. Okay. Which is a frigid beam of blue light streaks towards a creature with uh, towards a creature within range. I love Make that. a range special attack. Range spell attack. I should put my glasses on so I can actually read. A <laughs> uh, range spell attack against the target. On a hit, it takes a d8 of cold damage, and its speed is reduced by 10 feet until the start of your next turn. That doesn't so, have anything to do with I'm undead. Going... That's just being frozen. Okay. That's yeah, being frozen. Kick ass. Well, so... yeah. Give me a give me a a, a, a spell attack. Spell attack bonus. So I do an 18. 18 to hit. 18 does in fact hit. Give me some damage, sir. A massive one. Yes. I could have rolled <laughs> in the game. I would have gotten better than a Jesus one. Jesus Christ. Do you want to roll in the game? Have you done that yet? I haven't. Would you like to roll in the game? But that's okay. Okay. You no, throw a I'm d20 good. size ice cube. Yes. <laughs> Um, so I, 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 I to hit one damage. One damage. And slowed by ten. Let's give him a slow marker. Hold on one moment here. Uh, he's going to have a snail to represent his slowness. Uh, you have moved. You have attacked. Anything further you can do? Uh, nope, that's it. I'm good. It passes to Dostoff. How would you like to react, sir? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and move my little tortoise butt right to here. Here. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Ah, yep, there's right a there. flank involved on that thing. And I have a bit of confidence in this encounter, so I'm going to grab my Warhammer with both hands. Jeez. So starting oh. the shield. And I'm going to go ahead and make an attack with advantage. Kick ass. Thank God I have advantage. <laughs> and I'm going to add the inspiration. Sweet. Uh, does 15 hit? Oh, my God. It was cl- He tried to dodge that attack, and yet it still made contact. Please roll some damage. <laughs> yeah, it was all very slow-mo. He turned into Neo and did one of the... One of the whoa, but you, you swiped the, his face off. Uh, that's 11 points of damage. 11 coming off of him. And that is a full round. A total of six seconds have passed, and he is down. Are you ready for this? 261 hit points. On that note... What the hit point? Huh? Huh? What's a hit point? It's, it's, that thing. it's the breaded thing with the mayonnaise. On that note, I'm going to call it and say we'll pick, we'll pick this up next time because it is 4 o'clock and the rest of we all have lives that we need to lead. It's always fun to play, but we have to, we have to continue on. I'm going to leave this all up as is right here, and we're going to start with Rebel. Dawn, I really hope you get to join us again next time. Please, please, please. I'm hoping to. Uh, no, wait. Next weekend. Next weekend, I will uh, be celebrating my 10th year anniversary with my lovely bride. Oh, holy shit! A full fucking decade. God damn, sir. Hell yeah. 
That is that is okay. Yeah. Um, so I'm glad we got to get a chance. We to just get need another character to come back. <laughs> <laughs> perhaps you, perhaps well, Thief will also be out there looking for uh, real estate in the town. Of next Sunday, I think uh, I have a client meeting next Sunday. Oh, so we are I down to 